NASA just revealed what they're calling possible signs of life from Perseverance's exploration of Jezero Crater on Mars. One of the most intriguing things Perseverance has spotted are the so-called jaguar spots. On Earth, patterns like these can form when microbes grow across rock surfaces, leaving behind chemical stains that persist for billions of years. But that's not all. Perseverance also found that many of these rocks are rich in olivine, the greenish material over here. When olivine breaks down, it can release hydrogen gas and heat, a potential energy source for microbes. Layer all of this together, and include the fact that Perseverance's spectrometers picked up complex organic molecules, and you start to see why NASA got excited. And I'll be honest, I'm not as excited about this announcement as I feel I should be. Part of that is timing. Why make this declaration now? But could it be less about science and more about building momentum for the Mars sample return mission? Announcing possible signs of life might be exactly the kind of story needed to get public and politicians to fund it. Perseverance's jaguar spots and olivine-rich rocks may be the strongest hint yet of ancient life on Mars, or they may just be Mars geology doing a very convincing impression. The bigger question is, do these discoveries justify a multi-billion dollar sample return mission today, or should we wait until humans can collect Mars rocks in person? I'd love to hear your take in the comments.